I don't know if I'm saying that right. OG Luxury Organics. A lot of the ingredients in this stick are organic. Um, there's coconut oil. There's beeswax. I have it here so I could read some of this for you. Um, there are different vegetable sources. There is fruit oil. Um, jo jojoba seed oil, which is really, really hydrating your skin. I got this in a rose quartz because I've been needing um, like a blush stick. So it says that you can use this as, oh, it's also like really nice and it, it holds really nicely in your hand. And the, um, it's nice and like heavy and the top is magnetic. So just like, I just kind of love that. It just feels so luxurious. So I'm going to apply it where I apply my blush and we can see how this goes. You see. There we go. Look at that beautiful streak. And it's sort of this nice, warm rose color. Um, this is where I put my, my blush. And then I like to put like a little bit on my nose here. And it's just going to give us this beautiful, natural glow. Sometimes I rub this in with a brush, but I left that in the bathroom, of course, because it's Sunday. And my brain's not working. Is your brain working today? <laughs> but look at this beautiful, natural, and it's buildable. Wow, look at that. It looks so natural and creamy and it, it like brightened my face um, automatically. You can also get this stick in a darker color to contour underneath. I'll show you where I would put that, but I don't have the contour, the darker stick yet. I just have the blush and it goes on really light so that if you're putting on like, if you do a stripe and you don't feel like you did it in the right spot, which I do all the freaking time, like it's buildable. So it's not a huge deal. Um, my favorite place to put blush is right here because I do the contour here, right? You want to highlight your cheekbones. And then sometimes I do like a highlighter here. This is where I do the blush. It's my favorite spot. And you're just going to blend, blend, blend. I used to do it on like the apples of my cheeks and I realized that it was making me look really like full, full faced and kind of like a teenager in not a good way, like a child. <laughs> it was not good. So I learned on TikTok that it's supposed to be here. Um, so if this was a contour stick, I would also put it here. I'm just going to do it because I'll show you where the sun would go. A little bit here, a little bit here. Um, ooh, I'm getting some makeup on it. I don't want to do that because it's so pretty. How's everybody's day going today? I love Sundays. I feel like Sundays are so, they're so stress-free. You're kind of free to do whatever it is you want to do. Do you see like the natural, the natural warmth this gives my face here? I just love that. A little bit on the tip of the nose. So pretty. Okay, so moving on from this, please let me know if you have any questions about it. Um, the next most important thing for me, for my face, after we've done just a nice light foundation and of course SPF and then like a little bit of blush, this is like the easiest face routine I could, I could show you, is my brows. I have to do 